Hi, and welcome back to your Pennsylvania Dutch Minute, uh, coming to you in the new year with a new video. Uh, this one again comes from a viewer request. Um, again, at the end of every email, at the end of every video, that my email address is there. Uh, if there's a topic that you'd like me to make a video about, then please just send me an email and I'll do it. So I had a, a viewer write in asking for words and phrases that you would use at the dinner table. So I compiled a, a short list uh, and like to throw these at you right now. Just walk you through possibly getting ready for a meal and getting to the table. So the first phrase, what you would probably be telling people in your house to do, hey, go wash your hands or wash your hands. And the phrase for that in Pennsylvania Dutch is Vesh die hand. Vesh die hand. Then the next thing would be to set the table, and to set the table in Pennsylvania Dutch is Risht der Tisch. Risht der Tisch. Okay, now whoever's cooking might yell out, hey, Supper's ready. Actually, I've been giving the words for lunch and supper in case, you know, for whichever meal you're doing. Um, so the phrase would be S middagessa. That's the word for lunch. Middagessa. Or if you're talking about supper, Obedessa. Obedessa is ready. So the whole phrase would be S middagessa or S obedessa is ready. Okay. Then you might yell, hey, come eat, or come on, let's eat. And the phrase for that in Pennsylvania Dutch is, kum esse. Kum esse. Depending on your faith or family traditions, maybe someone would ask, who would like to pray, or who wants to pray. And the phrase for that in Pennsylvania Dutch is, wer will bede. Wer will bede. Uh, and then a phrase, you're at the table, you're eating, and you might say, pass me whatever. The phrase for pass me in Pennsylvania Dutch is lang mia. Lang mia. And something that would be on every table, salt and pepper, I'll give you those two words and then show you how the phrase you would use. So the word for salt is s sals. S sals. And the word for pepper is dao pepper. Dao pepper. So if you wanted to say to someone, hey, pass me the salt, use that phrase we said earlier, lang mia es sals, lang mia es sals, or pass me the pepper, lang mia de pepper, lang mia de pepper. I didn't put this on the, on the sheets to show you, but another phrase that you might hear or you might have people that you know use instead of saying lang mia would be just get mia, which means give me. So not quite as as polite, maybe as long mir. Get me as a little bit more of this. Hey, give me the salt. Get me a de, get get me as sals, for example, or get me a de pepper. Um, I mean, I use both at the table, and I never mean I never use the get me a phrase in a derogatory way or or a a un, impolite way. But long mir or get me would work as well. So there are some quick phrases that you can use at the table, whether it's lunch or dinner. It could be breakfast too. I didn't give you the word for breakfast. Maybe I'll do just a breakfast video. Uh, here in the future. Um, but uh, again, practice these, use them. Uh, and if, like I said earlier, if there's a topic that you would like to have me do a video on, don't be afraid. Just shoot me an email. My address is there at the end, busterpa at yahoo.com. Uh, I'll get back to you and throw a video together for you. Custom made. All right, till the next time, Mox Good and Schwetz Deitch.